it is a young adult in his 30s who wanted the prominent fat content in his anterior abdominal wall that is general term stomach above the waistline to be reduced generally this is a safe procedure done in a theater under general anesthesia which is best for the patient to tackle all areas of the abdomen preoperatively we mark the areas as circles and prominent areas that need to be tackled very well are drawn as circles and squares so measured amounts of uh, fat is sucked out uh, if you consider the anterior abdominal wall there are two halves and then upper and lower therefore each half can be matched how much of uh, fat is sucked out from each area so equal amounts will be sucked out and these sucking process is done with a power assisted micro air life suction apparatus all are sterile instruments with a small stab mark the, these cannuli are introduced there are various types of cannuli to suit the situation and uh, selected cannuli are used and these stab marks are in areas that are not going to be seen in the groin fold so once the procedure is over they heal up so no marks will be visible at all and once the procedure is done which takes about in this uh, client situation which takes about uh, uh, one and a half hours to two hours and then afterwards the, the area is wrapped with what we call a pressure garment this is a double binding uh, broad band so one or two bands which are provided by the hospital and these bands are immediately put on and the, the, the advantage is that uh, once liposuction is done there is a, there is a lot of uh, dead space uh, created so the band keeps these uh, dead spaces in, in the body under the skin uh, you must understand that liposuction is done uh, between the skin and the muscle therefore the dead space or extra space that is created is kept close, collapsed with this uh, pressure garment which the client is going to keep for, for the next 8 weeks removing intermittently and the areas, the stab wounds are closed and they are closed with blast and dissolving sutures and um, the area is kept dry for about uh, 5 days after which body bath, straight bath can be done and uh, he is discomforted for about 2 days for which he stays at home and walks about. We advise them to walk about, take a lot of liquids and then he gradually recovers and within about a, a, a week he is fully mobile. Within about three days he goes to work and within about a month he is completely recovered to uh, engage in uh, physical activities and so on. Therefore it's a very straightforward procedure, very uh, secure procedure uh, done in a theatre and there are no risks, unnecessary risks taken and theatre is a place that uh, the anaesthetist takes care of uh, all the uh, parameters during the procedure.